what, what's going on? These people have come to record us so that you go and report us to the government for that. We should stop what? Burning charcoal. Let, let's go. Let's go. The trees were planted by God. We came and we found the trees. God planted the trees. Don't you think God will plant another one? Eh. So chairman, the government is telling us not to cut trees. Is the government the one that planted the trees? Yes, we all understand it's not the government. But remember, the government is not a person, but we are the government. You are the government. He's the government. I'm the government. All of us are the government. Now, so what can we do? Huh? Listen, what can we do? You said listen, we should stop burning charcoal. What listen, can we do? Listen to me. Listen to me. The government has come to the policy that when you cut one tree, plant five. It is not for the government. It is for our own benefit. The government benefit out of it. We benefit out of it. Now, when you cut out all the trees, you drain all the swamps around, you can see how the charcoal burning is affecting our area. How shall we survive? Mr. Chairman, yes, like that. we do not about seedling. Yes. And how are we going to get the seedling? You are saying you will sold the plant. After cutting, you will sold the plant. How are we going to get the seedling? As we don't know how uh, about the seedling. Uh, thank uh, you very much. Yes. Thank huh? you very much. Yes. Thank you very much, Olaidek. Remember that I can't answer the question as per now, but somebody is there to answer the question. Please, yes. tell us more about it. Yes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Yes. In fact, if, if they can sit down, then we shall explain to them how we can get this. Okay. Please, yeah. let's get it. Please, let's get, 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 get it. Let's get it. Yes. In fact, thank you, Mr. Chairperson. You see, members, we are not here for any ill intention. Our intention to come here is to actually educate you more about the environment. As you can see, your environment has been all degraded. So for this case, some people are asking, how do we get the seedlings? These seedlings can be provided, first of all, by even some of you individuals yourselves. Two, uh, we have uh, the government advocates. You can reach them and they give you the seedlings. And even we have some other partners who are dealing with the government and in, 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 in eradicating the, the breakdown of the environment. For example, the Lefugiro project. When you come to them, we can see how we can help you to plant more what? trees so that we see our environment becoming better. What do you think your children have to enjoy in the future? If we destroy them now. Now, Mr. Man, for me as a ref as I'm now a refugee, I don't even need to plant a tree because anytime I'm going from here, why should I plant tree to this country? Of what benefit is it to me? Yet tomorrow I'm just going. What? Wh wh why is? Why should I plant? Yeah, that, that, is that is a good question. In fact, we are also encouraging refugees to plant more trees because who knows? We don't know when the war in your country will end. There are some people who have come here as refugees and have stayed here for more than 15 years. So don't you think that if you plant a tree now, after five years you may still be here and that tree will benefit you. So that's how we are encouraging everybody to do what? To plant these trees. So not only maybe the nationals but even what? The refugees. It is all our community now. We are living here together. This environment benefits all of us. You see, in this country, I am a national, I'm a Ugandan. We have refugees in this, uh, uh, in this settlement in the, all over the country. But these trees are, the people who are cutting down the trees are these refugees. Now, and you're encouraging us and stopping us from burning our charcoal. And the people, you know very well, the people who have contributed to this uh, forest degradation are the refugees. What can you say about that? It is true that uh, most of the, actually the, the bigger impact of this land degradation has been done by the refugees. Because they have been taking the settlement and the rest. But, uh, however, we need to find out uh, a, a, a long-term solution for this problem because uh, for example if these refugees are to go to their back to their home countries we, we assume that maybe they get peace now you as a national who is going to remain the only thing you're going to be affected so that's why we're encouraging all of us the nationals and the refugees to come together and plant more trees our message to you fellow ugandans and the refugees is that let's plant trees and hold deforestation <laughs> Ha <laughs>